Even the music, even the music is relaxing. Yeah, let's not try hard. It does need to be a creative mode, though. From what I understand, the only people still watching Halo are people who have got Stockholm Syndrome. existed like no other. This kingdom did not anchor its power. This kingdom took to the skies. The Airborne Kingdom traveled to every kingdom on the ground, sharing knowledge, culture, and tradition. Its great council guided the lands through a golden age. Yet, long before even our elders can remember, the Airborne Kingdom vanished. <laughs> the people sought to continue their harmony, but self-interest began to overrule. The land's three regions slowly isolated. Trade, travel, connections all unwound. Kingdoms contracted. And small settlements nearby were nearly wiped away. Bygone times turned to legend. But in the tapestry, we found instructions. A blueprint to remake the technology of the ancients. A prophecy to restore the airborne kingdom. Did we make our own airborne kingdom? With blackjack and all hookers? There was but one belief we had wrong that day. Though it proved vital. For such a finding was no chance at all. I'm not a huge fan, Rydog. Like, I, I wouldn't not drink it if it was offered to me, but I also wouldn't buy it by choice again. Uh, all our painstaking efforts have succeeded. Our home flies, yet this is only the beginning. To truly rebuild the ancient vision, we need to find every kingdom upon the lands and befriend them as common allies. We also need inhabitants to form our great council in this new empire. We should start with the kingdom of Rat Ratu Ratula, not far from us, and the only kingdom we know. But first we must build houses and find supplies. Oh, are you done telling me how the game works? Okay. Uh, entrance not connected to pass. Um... I don't know if we have any paths. Oh, okay. So you can kind of add too much weight to certain sides. All right. That's an interesting mechanic that probably will get me killed at some point. How much housing do we need? Uh, nine inhabitants, but only one house. We're doing it. Oh, we can't afford that right now. Okay. The find it best how you found it as well. Yeah, like I definitely would not uh, go... Cr oh, looks like we need... Is it a house per inhabitant? Can I build high rises? Not yet. Oh, that's a little bit fast. All right, now I can't afford anything. How do I know if we're gathering anything? Uh, two ar up arrows required. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I 
don't know what any means. Uh, stores something is fuel for the large fan, which is then connected to all lift buildings that also need. I'm assuming it's coal. If our coal ever depletes, our home will fall to the ground. We all, I know to always be wary of our reserves. Provides 40 uplift for 0 0.5 per hour. Okay. Okay, I understand. So we're using 25 or 40 of our lift. Um, all I can build is paths because we don't have trees, which is here. We're not collecting any either. Um, can I move the kingdom? People do seem to be going off and getting trees now. How many can I send from a single hangar? Seven? Seven aircraft. I'm assuming that'd be seven people. I don't know how we make coal. Uh, construction from the platform is hard. You must reset any new constructions at an academy. Okay, can I build an academy? I can. But we need to do houses first. We've got more trees. What else have we got around us? This looks like a town of some sort. Or maybe a temple. In before Keiki tore into the game saying it is rubbish. It's definitely a, a lot. I like how all the planes do a loop to loop before they land. That's just showing off. Um, it's a lot more relaxing than the previous game we were playing. Fifty-six. Fifty-six what? Purge the non-believers. It does have a nice atmosphere. God, we need 30 trees. There's only four left here, I think. I think that's what this four means. Yeah. Looks like we need to collect water, food as well. I don't know how we do foods. Hey, cheers for the let, Nelly. Hope your meeting goes well. Also, it's stone. Water as well here. Oh, there's also a balloon here.
don't know what that is. That looks like a, a structure. This also looks like a village here. Oh, I need five people? I suppose that means five idle people. We've only got three. gonna be fun when I start to make this thing tilt by mistake um I'm assuming we grab more people by going to settlements camera controls are a little bit sensitive at times Oh, this is coal. This isn't stone. Okay. We definitely want to pick up coal. Coal is what keeps us afloat. A loaf? What a fine looking loaf of bread. Um. God, I really couldn't have picked two more different games today, could I? <laughs> and tomorrow there'll be yet another new game. Super trip. Um, why is this yellow? Because it's full. Let's put more people on coal patrol. Did he play Guildmaster mode to really figure out the mechanics and then be offered a free DLC for the game to play after he tore it apart? Not yet. Alright, so. Make sure no one's trying to clear for things. Let's head to the small settlements. We approach a hovel on the edge of nowhere. Some settlers may wish to join us to leave the land's toil behind. A few of the sets seem intrigued by a vision, but they want assurances that they're leaving for a happier home. The sun-caked faces were as hard as leather. Most workers ignored our presence and continued their thankless tasks. From Tales of the Old Settlers by Mulab, the second chronicler. Uh, let's take you. An eager migrant was something important that can't be left behind. Overall satisfied inhabitants on the AK. Okay. But where are we without many desires met? Alright, we took all of them. Uh, they're not going to have houses. Can I still build the academy? There is still coal. There's a lot of coal there. What is this? Is this food? Yes. Alright, let's move over here. Uh, now that you've built an academy, we can start to research new technology. Okay? I think I have to start from here. I did take most of our trees. I think there were some trees nearby. 
Oh, it's too far. Okay. Are these also trees? No, that's clay. Oh, dear. Yeah, Chan, what were your thoughts about... Um, oh, God, what was it called? Turbo Overkill. Yeah, we could probably move a little bit more central for everybody. I definitely enjoyed it. I'll definitely be back. Not sure how much long, like how much more gameplay has got left, like level wise. Now uh, you added it to your wish list, enjoyed it, and also think you would enjoy playing it. If they add multiplayer, and I have no idea if it's even on their agenda, like on their list. If they add multiplayer, I think that would be a really fun uh, multiplayer shooter. Do you work at night? Yes. Yes, you do. It's a nice, fairly basic art style. I don't mind it. Uh, transform clay into bricks. Workers don't like living near the kiln because of its fumes. Okay. So, housing block provides shelter for one. We know that already. Oh, I see. We can research different things. Oh, no. We already know these now. Interesting. Uh, regain more resources, removing or destroying a building. Go faster, more coal storage. Yeah, let's go for more coal storage. Let's try and stay afloat, shall we? Oh, you can see the people. Hello, the people. There is some more coal here we can grab if we wait for the research to complete. Uh, I think we've grabbed all... Nope, we haven't grabbed all the food. I don't know if I actually sent anyone to grab food in the end. It's the whole reason we came here, but I don't think I told anyone to grab food. It seems like a game we'll see a lot until you beat it. Uh, assign workers to hunt for diamonds at this ruin. Relics are highly valued by all kingdoms. Alright. Send in Indiana Jones. I knew I'd done that wrong. How does one destroy? Oh, dear. All right, food is almost full. How do I know how well my research is going? I don't think I can just track it on the screen. I'd like to build a kiln, but I don't know how far away it has to be. Um, okay, it tells me. Good. My weekend was pretty good, honestly. I, I smoked a river beef, which turned out lovely. Really, really nice. Um, probably could have cooked it slower. Um, so I got a, like a better smoke ring, but like the, the outside, the actual smoke taste was delicious. Um, 
probably for my taste at least overcooked the beef just a tiny amount but it was still gorgeous and it was lovely the next day cold in a sandwich it's oh that's good stuff uh rib of beef not river beef but i only did that because it was half price in the shop because it was going out of date beef going out of date um all right so we don't need people oh there's some trees we can collect did i just tell you to move because i honestly didn't want to i wanted to find the foods and stop people collecting from it but i can't see it anymore is this the food we were collecting from no Uh, it's water buffalo or beef going out on a date so yeah so it was 12 pound for that joint i got which um i thought was pretty decent so i picked it up can i like count what my workers are doing by doing it here by any chance no Oh, there's the one we're working on. All right. I click on the academy. Can I see how my research is doing? Nope. A nearby forest has been fully chopped and replanted. It will regrow in time. All right. Are you back from here? Yep. Oh, God. The, the camera is a little, little dodgy at times. Uh, I think wood is where we kind of want to push for next. I don't know what this is. Quartz. A number of small ponds glow with strange colors next to a small abandoned settlement. The walls of the building are dyed in a similar color to the waters. The source of the pigment is a mystery, but it appears we can change the colors of our own buildings with these new dyes. Uh, we take the dyes to customize our own buildings. Painting things, you say? Well, this game just went up in my estimations. Um... All right, will you not let me go that far because I'm reaching the end of the map, or I can only go so far from my base? This is where we were trying to head for. Um, and there is a forest over here, so yeah, sure. <laughs> I'm happy now. <laughs> I mean, as soon as I find the pink dye, or the purple... I can make the lights purple. Yeah, there we go. Oh god, it makes the hangar look dangerous. I wouldn't go in that purple hole. Oh, that's a clay deposit. This wasn't trees. Well, we did build a kiln, so we probably should get some. All workers are busy. Where else do I have workers out then? Oh, you just automatically make it. Oh, that's probably where my workers are going then. Okay. Can I shut down a building without destroying it? It's got to be some kind of worker management, surely. I don't know. I don't know. Everyone is way too happy to be living in a village that I'm looking after, but 
I'll accept it. Oh, we demolished that. <laughs> oh, now it's getting light. There's no lights on. Boo. Stay dark. I like my purple lights. Also, my camera just flipped all the way around again. There's a few trees there. Kingdom of Rutula. To fulfill the prophecy, we must have Ratula allied with us, our machines, all the crowds, and give an audience with the queen. We may also seek ancient blueprints that we can combine with our own knowledge to make wondrous technology. Uh, so they seek our assistance. Uh, yeah, let's see what quest we got. They seek our assistance for an important task. The queen tells that the great conservatory is in ruin. If only we could find the resources and lend some of our workforce to its reconstruction. Completing such requests is the first step to gaining a kingdom's trust and eventually reconnecting them together to establish the prophecy once more. So rebuild the Great Conservatory. We need... Oh, so actually, if I had the workers, we could just do this straight away. Um, sadly, I can't change the camera to like bring some workers back. Which is a little bit of a pain in the ass. So if I take one from here... And one from here. Uh, we must wait nearby for its completion. That's fine. Uh, we search for technologies in the depths below Ratula. We must pay to have them uh, excavated and to work in the sky. We must research what we find further. But these should be a start. All right, the only thing we can afford is the glass smelter. I feel like the wing, we can afford it now, so we'll buy it. Uh, we seek to trade for coal. Oh, I can't sell. Oh, I'd probably sell other things for other things. All right. How do I know when that thing is done? All right, we can take the guy off food. I think there are some trees here. Oh, no, that's an empty forest. Also an empty forest. I hate empty forests. Um, just murder them and take them over. Afford it now, so buy not the best. I know. How are we doing for water? All right, we've got plenty of coal. a big forest over there and another temple can we reach this oh possibly okay it seems a slow to start game oh this is okay there was a progress bar for the rebuilding okay Uh, the conservatory is complete. Great. Uh, with our resource and labor, the conservatory is again whole. Upon seeing our efforts, a couple of locals join our cause, agreeing to take part in our great council. Yet the great conservatory is still withered, its grove rotted. The queen asks us to find a sapling from the golden trees of Caldoir to replant their once beautiful gardens. The exact whereabouts of the trees is unknown, but their rumored location is marked on our map. We'll find your golden grove. Right, now when you say marked on the map marked how that's us oh here okay so 
I kind of want to head northeast ish. So, in that direction. Uh, but before. Actually, no, there are some trees there we can grab. Uh, we do need to build some more houses. Uh, but before we do that, we're going to build some more paths. Oh. And now we're out of trees. All right, so... Northeast-ish. Wait, was I not looking this way last time? Um, right, we can pull you back from that. I thought there was a forest in this direction. There's one there. Remind you of the beaver game? I would say so far that I'm enjoying this more than the beaver game and I feel it has more potential. Um, I don't know if they've updated the beaver game since I played it. Also, just saying the beaver game just sounds wrong. Um, but... <laughs> um, but yes, I don't know if they've added more depth to it. My problem with Timberwood is that I kind of got to a point where all I was doing was like trying to collect water, I think it was. We are not a fast ship. Uh, because of the drag on our buildings, we can only move at 46% of our fastest speed possible. Add propulsion buildings to increase this amount. Yeah, I know you don't have homes. That's why we're trying to get some more trees. Have we still not researched the bloody more coal storage yet? Surely it's been six hours. Right, more trees. Don't know what that is. More trees. Is there any coal out here? That's clay. That's a settlement. So yeah, we're fairly close to where we want to be searching around. Oh, I need to get 150 people on this ship before I renew the Airborne Kingdom. That might take a while. Um... No, 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 no. Cancel, cancel that, cancel that. Stay where you are. Do you slow sink if you don't have power? I don't know if it's slow or immediate. <laughs> if you want to know the truth. Oh, the Golden Grove. That's what we were looking for. But yes, so look, I'm I'm at almost my capacity for lift, so I need to be thinking about researching something that can give me more lift because I don't think we have anything yet.
now i don't know if the game will let you build beyond your lift capacity and you just die or if it will just say you can't build this you don't have enough lift i'm gonna guess it's number two uh, we are still researching i don't know where i can click on to see what we are researching I don't know. Oh no, canvas is just something we can grab. Um, oh, there is a stop button if you just want it to not move. Okay, good. There's our research tree. We were researching. Okay, this will be complete in one hour. We can't do anything. Right, can we research anything in lift? No. Um. You prefer the crash and burn option? Alright, what do I want to research next? So we're almost as big as we can be. Um, so I think just making everything more efficient. But for now is going to be our best bet. All right, so we've completely demolished that. Uh, there is food over there. There's a thing over there, but then there's also this. Uh, a small grove of brilliant gold trees. Those are the golden trees. Uh, you harvest a sapling, careful to not disturb the grove that remains. We must return to the kingdom of Rotula. All right, will do. I believe there was a lot of coal by Rotula, which was, which is over here. Uh, let's stop. No, I don't want to pick up any more people right now. Let's go back to Rutchula straight away. Please we all need to be careful attention to tilt. Yep, we got that. We got that. Uh we'll build any bit of Tribute. Okay. I think we've worked most of this out by ourselves. Uh build enough rolls. Yep, 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 yep. Over your mouse along the top bar will show information panels which show yep. Uh yep. And yep. Alright. I do like the fact that your camera is kind of limited to how far it can go away from your base so you can't just explore the whole map. Look at it, it's moving so fast. I also don't understand why my mouse destroys clouds. <laughs> the power. Also, I don't think we cast a shadow, unless that's it. I think that might be it. Or that could also be cloud. That was cloud. lift does the house take that's half the academy is two uh food silo is two warehouse is three water tower is two
Uh, as it flourishes, new growth spring nearby, which we can harvest for wood. A few more Rutulins also join our cause. No, with the grove replanted, the Rutulins are convinced of our prophecy. They agree to ally with us. To seal our allegiance, we must build a skyport to connect their kingdom with our own. Um, insufficient aircraft, build more hangars. Okay. I don't know if we've got the weight for more hangars. All right, first things first. How many houses do we have? 14, 23 more houses. And a hangar needs... Two, we can just about do it. Yes, I know we're almost at our lift capacity. Don't worry about it. Maybe I shouldn't have built the kiln already. I'm back, baby. Hey, welcome back, Nerdy. I need 10 clay. All right, maybe we... Uh... Sorry, 10 bricks. Maybe we should have built the kiln already. Is there any clay nearby that is... Here's some matches. Set yourself on fire. All right, we don't need people gathering food anymore. Um, I think we've already got people gathering coal from over here. We've got maybe some more for water. Um, <laughs> oh dear all right we need one more brick you can speed up time incidentally it's just uh, as i'm getting used to the mechanics i tend to play these games fairly slowly So that clay deposit has been demolished. Uh, there was another one. Was there another one? propulsion high cost no fuel okay so the wing is what gives us lift it's probably what we need to try and buy next time we uh, loot a uh, temple i'm worried that they're gonna bring more people on board when we finish this off nearby oh there's a temple here in fact by temple i mean relic uh, technically it's a ruin relics are what we're looking for i wonder if i'm a docked at the skyport we don't have to waste coal and such 
I very much doubt it, but that would be quite nice. I believe that's our Skyport. It's just a hangar with a fancy name. Um, yay, we've gained an ally. Woohoo! <laughs> Great. Uh, with the Skyport complete, Ratchet is now connected to us and its neighbors. A great number of workers have also joined our cause. Shit. The office supplies were plus one wood every hour. Now they're connected to the skies. It should be easy. We must find the other kingdoms and connect them as well. Then all peoples will enjoy collective harmony and the prophecy will be complete. We turn to other matters. Upon sealing our allegiance, the locals tell us one last forgotten myth of the ancients and their knowledge. But the legends say the Aeopol kingdom held three distinct wonders atop its flying platform. Each wonder shone with splendor and imbued great knowledge and ability to its builders. Yet when the great capital disappeared, these wonders were lost as well. The tales say they were scattered to the winds and that their, their pieces lay among the lands. Perhaps in finding some of the lost parts, we can rebuild these wonders. We gather every detail about their functions and rumoured whereabouts. Okay, I cannot build enough houses. Oh, no, 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 maybe I can. We've got five relics. Uh, we need to buy a wing. And then let's see how we build them. Oh, do I have to research it even though I just brought it? Yes. Hey, see you, Trunks. Have a good rest of your day. And thank you for stopping by. It's very much appreciated. All right, so we don't need anybody collecting. I wish there was a generic stop work button uh, we got plenty of water we got plenty of foods um, all right now we're gonna have to research the nope I need some more brick on that goddamn wing um We've been to fluorescent ponds already, haven't we? Yes. Um, it's a big forest over there. Some big coal deposits. The nearby clay. That's coal. That's coal. Um, okay, so I think we've got 14 clay, I think. Um, so to make it quicker, we don't have to wait for another um, kiln. So I think we're just going to have to move around a little bit. Right, let's head over here. Well, they're only moving at 41% of our top speed now. Alright, chat, we're about an hour in. What are your thoughts on this game so far? Yes, I know we don't have homes. We don't have the weight to build more homes. We've got to build these wings. We've got to research these wings first. Oh god, that's as fast as it goes. When you speed the game up. Uh, 
No, I need to research my wing, which is going to take two hours. We're going to be better off around there somewhere. That might be a settlement, although again, I don't think I want more people. Oh, there is a temple though. Let's see if we can find some more diamonds. We found five relics. All right, what are we desperate for? Um, grab some quartz, we'll grab a little bit more food. Uh, put one on water as well. All right, we now have a wing. How expensive are wings? All right, and how do they work? So they have to connect to a path. Can I build two? No, we don't have enough clay. Um, we don't have enough brick. We may have enough clay. Um, but they move up and down. I'm going to say this is a steady wing, but I might be wrong. It does provide lift, so yeah, it may flap. Looks like it's got cogwheels and stuff. Um... They're uh, not really seeking anybody quite yet. Alright, we've now got 50 left. Totally needed that. I've somehow made these houses not even. And I hate myself for it. All right. Um, now we're out of words. <laughs> All right, let's research. I'd quite like to get some of these things built. Um, we may not actually be able to research anything. I think more lift. We'll just take more lift from a wing. Does this increase our coal cost? No. I still don't have enough houses. Oh, that's right. We were waiting for wood. And then I spent all of my woods on a warehouse. Hmm. 
I'm assuming I can build paths around the wing and then like kind of have the uh, the wing enclosed eventually. Oh, they moved from constructing it. Uh, that, that wasn't the plan. Um, Once we have more food storage, we can start to grab more food. There we go. Now she's cooking with gas. What do we need? Two more houses? Yes. Nobody is idle, so I'm not going to send anybody out for food quite yet. Can I build a second wing? I can when I bring people back. Whose gas am I cooking with? Well, not Russian gas. Oh, are we grabbing food from here as well? We don't really need that. Um, oh, just our generic storage is also pretty full as well. So we could do it getting a warehouse. Um, right, we don't need anyone collecting water right now. I'm going to put two more people on. I really want this to be... I think that's right. It wasn't. It's off by one. Oh well. Oh well. these come from um oh these are the these are the wonders that the game was talking about okay all right that helps with lift now we can risk building some extra houses um Okay, no, that's not counting as a path because that's the house. Okay. Upper of our speed's got to be really slow now. We've got nothing that will do propulsion. Um, we've already set that. We're almost ready to move on. Um, oh, 
Oh, there's another temple there. That's too far. Come on, you slow bastard. <laughs> I'll try and find more engines at some point. I promise. Might also be another settlement over here. I don't think that's the one we clicked on before. Maybe it was. All right, so we could do with a warehouse. It's only going to make everything slower, though. Oh, the warehouse is big. I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. It's a, a little bit slow to get going, but I'm... Honestly, I don't mind that it's slow. It's, it's kind of just a nice game to kind of relax to right now. I'm sure that will change eventually. What was the other thing we could research at the at the big town? Was it propulsion based? No, it was a windmill, wasn't it? Still got nothing for propulsion or desires. Um, okay, that's just an increase of what we can store without having to build something new. Let's do that. Uh, we got room for one more person. We are now known as the Airborne Community. Great. As the community grows, doubts and fears begin to form among the migrants from other kingdoms. How can we survive in the skies forever? Traditional believers in the light, the people are worried that they have lost its guidance, both physically and spiritually. They need these desires fulfilled. We must shine lights on all our paths to make our people feel safe when walking in the skies, or we can build centers of faith so that the light may guide them spiritually. These constructions will help provide our inhabitants' desires. We know of neither construction at the start of our journey, but surely other kingdoms have ideas we can research to make in the skies. Alright, so this might be a new giant kingdom here, actually. Definitely looks like it. Um, Alright, let's slowly make our way over here. I kind of like that it's equal city builder, equal exploration. And you take your base with you. satisfied now I need one I need to fulfill one desire all right I'll build the blackjack call as soon as I can I do like this little boat we've got in the middle Stock up on coal, although honestly we've got plenty. Food, there doesn't seem to be any. There's a little pool of water there, quite a bit of clay. Quite a bit of wood just up there, some more quartz. Let's 
Something tells me that since these are called fields or something, that we're probably going to have to fix irrigation issues so there will be food here. Uh, we're flying the city because there was an ancient prophecy about people who could fly cities and they brought everybody together and we're just trying to copy them. Because, you know, progress. Also, I like your penis, Windmills. Uh, Agamans is surrounded by tilled land, though the fields sit withered and untended. We may seek audience with their queen to understand their plight and encourage their allegiance to our cause. We speak to the queen whose mind is troubled. The water tables underneath uh, have stopped flowing, turning all nearby water brackish. Her crops, once the pride of the empire, can barely feed her own people. This underground water is churned by a pump built by the ancient airborne kingdom at the foot of the flow. It may need repair, but any brave party she sends cannot cross the barrens to find it. The queen marks the pump's rumored location on our map. If we wish to ally and restore the empire, we must prove to her we can build and maintain as well as the ancients. All right, we'll find your pump. Uh, do you have any... Oh, here we go. Generates propulsion, high cost, average fuel, two workers, average speed. We've got 12 diamonds. Oh, this provides... Wait, oh, yeah, faith is a desire. Oh, we can have a water condenser and a farm. Ooh. Um, there's only one food for one water every three hours. Is that good? I think we have to buy the faith. And I think right now it's more important that we have propulsion. Then another lift. Can I afford all of them? I'm going to have to research all of these. We are going to research. Oh, yeah, we've got to wait for the storage research to finish first. All right, so roughly where do you think this pump is? What you're saying is you've got no fucking clue where the pump is. All right. <laughs> we were told it was some, roughly in our land. Um... My guess is it's probably over here somewhere. How are we doing for coal? Okay, so we finally run out of clay. Is there a clay deposit here? Trying to fill up on certain things. Let's, uh, we grab a little bit of coal. Uh, water would be good. That's an empty oasis. All right, so there is no water here. Um, we don't move very fast. There was water back where we came from. And then we can head over here. Or do we just head over there and hope there's water? This is probably the wrong decision. The ground is like... Yes! Oh, the ground. Yes. It is like tile flooring. I don't mind it. It's quite pretty in its own way. Alright, I want to... Learn my propeller. Thank you very much. Let's get some more speed out of this mamma jamma. Before everybody dies of first. There is no water. That's an empty oasis. Oh god, even with our warehouse, we're almost full. We're collecting too much shit. <laughs> it's 
it's giving it that kind of feel like um like it feels very like aladdin-esque so arabian maybe they're going for like a more turkey vibe i don't know what they're going for here All right, we're out of water, so we've got to go back to where we knew there was some. Come on, research, you're almost done. So this does actually fill in to show you how far the research is getting on. I've just noticed that. That's kind of dumb of me, but. All right, can I? Less coal usage. Yeah, that's probably the best thing to go for, even though we haven't built one yet. All right. We can afford one. Can I just kind of slide in anywhere and it will work? You. You won't quite fit in there, even though you look like you should be able to fit. Must need clear space in the front. We should have researched that faith building, actually. Oh, not even their little building lights are purple. They build with glow sticks. That's the future. And they build by walking forwards. All right, we're now up to 90% speed. Here we go. Can you really call yourself a flying kingdom if you don't go really, really fast? Uh, this would be nice from a raft approach. Yeah, it would. our water storage would be a good idea how much lift have we got no i didn't tell you to move all stop uh, that's bigger than i was hoping it would be Now they may not build. No, no, we're going to on construction. We should be good. He says, where did I build my water tower? There it is. can't have that much left anyone building yes
Well, chat, I think we've had one of those rare days where we've tried two new games and I've enjoyed them both. Doesn't bode well for the new game I'm going to try tomorrow. Can we make it three in a row? Oh, that seems like a hard bet. We set this relic. We did. Relic, temple, whatever the fuck you are. Has that ever happened? I don't think so. Alright, we'll just kind of um, stay here while we uh, stock up. Which probably means we can speed up. Alright, we can bring people a food, put them all on water. Uh, yes, just one new game tomorrow. And then we'll I'll play something that isn't new as well. I imagine the game we play that isn't new is going to be Turbo Overkill. Because I think that has a finite lifespan. So we'll just... Um, we'll play it for as long as we can. Alright, let's slow back down. Let's... How are we doing? We're doing all right, so I think we can start to uh, look for this thing. So we kind of want to head to the east. We're only 83% now. God, these cities really weren't that far apart from each other to uh, have lost contact. <laughs> Although I don't know how big, like, one of these tiles may represent, like, 100 miles. Okay, so we already uh, stole everything from the temple. What am I, British? Um... There's an oasis that's got water in it. In the kind of search zone, which kind of makes me think that possibly the pump is over there. There's also a building here. This could be the pump. Um, oh god, my camera. Turned all the way around. I want to head towards this. I'll grab a little bit of coal on our way past. No, I'm French. I see old Macron won the election. Uh, are you birds here to tell me something? Because you don't seem to be moving. Or are you just very slowly? You better not shit all over my nice flying city. This looks like a water pump. It's called an ancient well. Uh, what we may confuse for a well is in fact the water pump we seek. Those mechanisms have long ago withered. With some brief study, our workers believe they can fix it with some resources. We must find resources and send workers. Yeah, I kind of get the basic gameplay. Uh, loop. Alright, well, seeing as we've got to wait here, we may as well send out some people for foods. We can do gathering some more woods. Looks like we've got water here as well. Let's 
the clay in range? That's a shame. Uh, looks like there's a relic over there. Any clay over here? If we head over here, there's another settlement. Possibly grab some more people. Speed this up a little bit. Yes, I know I don't have any clay. Hush now. Would I live on a flying city? Do you know, I don't think I would. I'd be constantly worried it'd run out of fuel. Uh, the mechanism grind and Sparta would start to turn and soon the wind spin the pumps naturally. As we look out across the valley, we see red oasises turn clear, a sign that the water tables are flowing again. I would really have to trust who was in charge of the flying city or have to look after it myself, which is a guarantee it would crash, but at least it'd be my fault. Uh, we must turn to Alchemist to speak with the Queen and see if our efforts have succeeded in rejuvenating their farms. We shall return eventually. Um, I kind of want to hit the settlement up. There's coal over there. All of these oases are starting to fill up. There's clay over here. Ah, maybe we'll come back out this way. You would ensure you had safety precautions on your house, but yeah, you would live on a flying city. Yeah, and it wouldn't I wouldn't want to live on a flying city. A flying house? Which I could then dock with other cities if I needed to to buy shit, maybe? But look at all these people. There's 25 other people on this flying city. That's like 24 too many people. Guess it depends on how it's flying in orbit, sure. Yeah, if we come up with some cool sci-fi no power crystal based gravity nullify, sure. Propellers? Well maybe not on that. We got we got propellers. We might put a couple of balloons up as well to help at some point. Alright, so I think we have to Oh, I need free glass. Alright, we gotta start thinking about building the uh, glass thing then. Um God, that's a long research though, but honestly I'm not gonna do anything else, so yeah. Where's my city? There it is. Wee. All right, we still got 10 more lift. What I don't know is because I put this warehouse in an awkward position just because I was trying to make this look more like a ship. Uh, I don't think I can fit in my... Oh, we never researched it even. Can I stop research? No. All right, well, that was a mistake. All right, we need to go back to Ag Agamemnon, which is this one? Nope, that's Rotula. Oh, shit. Did I come the wrong way? That's the same goddamn city. Is it this one? Yes.
More propellers. I wonder if I can get it to 110% speed. I need a Scotty working here. Alright, first things first. Let's start collecting some more coal so we don't crash. Um, it's looking a little bit more lush, but no foods. So there might be another quest. Uh, the Queen Smile beams to greet us. Her farmers flourish once more, including new wild growths that spring nearby, which we can harvest for food. A few new agrimans are so impressed that they wish to join our council. With the farms renewed, the Queen is convinced of our prophecy. She agrees to allegiance. Oh, only one quest for you. We must build... Oh, we have to build the Skyport. Well, we can do that straight away. Um... We're going to need more houses. And at some point, we're going to need a bigger boat. How many more houses do I need? Three. Alright, coal is almost full. Where's this? Oh, this is food here now. It's still called a thicket, but it definitely looks more like a farm. Not that we're really desperate for food right now. This will get us more colors, so we definitely want to head here. It's all about the colours, baby. Right, coal is full, so we can take you off that. Um, we don't have any iron. That's too far? Wow. We now have another ally. Great. Uh, oh, no. More workers? The office supplies with one wood every hour. Now that we are connected to the skies, it should be easy. Okay. Uh, we need more houses. We used all of our wood. Ah, oh, shit. We had so much wood. Some wood over here. this it yes we can what colors did we get oh kind of pink i'm not seeing the pink collecting lots of words we got a lot of idle people though um this is going to demolish that are you dem where do you reckon the next city is gonna be I just want to keep on heading north. 
which is this way. Alright, should be able to build the houses by now. We may need to think about another wing. We haven't researched that other method of staying up yet. Which may be smaller and easier to build. Oh, I need one more. No, maybe we don't. We've got enough houses. Okay. Uh, I mean, at least with the wing, we can build it straight away. to have water and foods. There's something there. There's also something over here. Temple by the look of it. I'm reminded so much of this world of how I've decided to build this. It, it, this is like a turtle before you put its uh, shell and stuff on. Where are the elephants? food over here and some clay let's just keep on heading this way we do need to think about glass uh, there's a ruin over here I don't know what that is a settlement here there's water as well um all right, i need glass before i can research that so which means i need to research the glass maker Let's get that going. We may need another warehouse. I don't like this empty bit I've left here. Okay, you can kind of cancel it if you do that. Hmm. I don't like the fact that the propellers move. Do the propellers always have to be at the front? leave enough did i leave a gap between that wing and that water tower i did not
All right, I'm assuming a glass melt is going to have a smell radius. Yes. All right, we completely emptied that oasis. Um... I don't really want to look for more people yet. I do want to head towards this ruin that we found. Because this might be the ruin we need to find for the next settlement, which... Or could be one that's got one of the missing pieces of the wonders. That looks like a settlement over there. Yeah, it's all mediocre now. Uh, can I research my faith building yet? Yes. Okay. Uh, a squat frame holds an ancient wind spinner. A small settlement is formed around it, though the spinner itself had been broken for a long time. Are we looking to recruit? Not really. Sorry and all that. All right, where did I think I saw the settlement? It came from over here. It's over there. Institute Child Labor. I hope you have a coal deposit. There's one there. All right, we now have faith. Um, oh, 32 hours research. Jesus H. Christ. Let's research the fan. That will give us another lift option. Um, now I'm assuming I want to put this... Oh, that's not a wide area for these. And it gives a lot, a huge amount of tilt. All my planning for houses. It's up the swanee. Malaya Passage. Uh, Malaya is a small kingdom but efficient. Their people vary machinery to work the land. Our attempts to ally are met with blank stairs. They find the technology entertaining but ultimately think it's useless. We must prove our worth. Uh, with no leader to convince, our demonstration must be directed at the public. The melee and wind spinners are key to the kingdom's efficiency but one of the three no longer functions. We learn there used to be many of these planes in the days of the ancients but they've all been lost. If we can find one more working spinner and return it, surely they would see the value in our cooperation. I have a feeling that's where we were. Uh, generates. Okay, some more propulsion. Oh, no fuel propulsion here. Street lamp, I think, is going to be the easiest way for us to do uh, faith. And we can make coal from trees. Um, right, let's pick up the, I think I'm going to pick up the ore as well. Yeah. Oh God, I've apparently found the button for the, um, Let's research the ore. All right, before we go anywhere, I need a coal bed. I'm pretty sure we just have to go back to where we were. I, I think that structure is what we needed to find. Oh, 
What's the chat? We're getting very close to the end of stream time. Oh no, someone left our kingdom. What did they do? Just jump off? Uh, what do I think about a FPS game where you gather resources and build buildings? I think it could be uh, highly enjoyable. All right, let's slow things down a little bit. Um, I need to research the light next. Heavy tilt. We also found out about the fan. Okay, this has got a radius around it as well, which is interesting. All right, did we send people down to get coal? We did. We're now up to 91% of speed, which is good. Nobody on building? No, we got one on construction. What are they building then? Why, have you seen one LP or? Oh, you sent me something Discord? Okie dokie. Research possible. After researching how to build Minaret and Street Lamp, we now have an idea for a new building shrine. Okay, that's kind of how those work. That's interesting. Oh, we can increase the range of the Minaret. That's kind of interesting. Alright, these street lamps. didn't build my city with this kind of thing in mind. Also, they're apparently quite heavy. It's like every game, wait and see. Did I put my... Oh, this, you're kind of... You're a lot smaller than I thought you'd be. Oh, you haven't been built yet. Didn't research anything. Um, Let's see how stacked housing works. Now, where was that? Okay, we are kind of going in the rough direction.
Look at it, chat. It's majestic. That's the place I think we're looking for. Although it wasn't spinning, so maybe it's not the place we're looking for. Workers are busy. So we've only had one person jump off our ship rather than uh, stay here so far. That's good. I now know when I build that you need to leave room in your houses for faith buildings. I mean, I should have known. I have played games like this before. That made people happy. Inhabitants with 66% pass were well lit. Only 11% pass well lit. They're scared of the dark, God damn it. We ask of the wind spinner. Uh, I mentioned in Melee of the Settlers' Gaffs, the settlement originates from a band of million explorers lost in the waste and unable to return home. We are told conditions in the settlement have worsened, their wind spinner's tinning connection is broken and it no longer turns, so they think the spinner's parts can be used to fix the one in Melia. Uh, you should play this in the other mode that actually tells you how to play it. They agree to bring the components. If only we return with the settlers who wish to go back with us. We agree and set off. We shall return the settlers and the wind spinner parts. Okay. Uh, we've run out of clay. I think north is the way we go for the... Um... Oh, 64 weight from buildings with bids carry. Oh, we've got heavy tilt. Yes, now that you mention it, I, I can see we are tilting a little bit. <laughs> now that you bring it to my attention... Donkey Kong you don't think that's how flying works oh no someone else just jumped from our kingdom um I'm not really ready for more people to join me but sure uh our new members agree that they should repair it themselves so they know it's working so however they need materials and time to make it function again all right let me just have to wait while they fix their wind spinner Oh, the amount of people who joined just filled up the people who jumped to their doom. So, uh, that works. Is that... Okay, I think they do actually jump out when they're unhappy. I think this is him jumping out on a parachute. <laughs> oh. Amazing. not going to help our tilt 
I need to build something with front tilt. I don't think building something at the back, like at the front with back tilt, necessarily levels it out. Although then again, maybe it does. I think it does. Okay. All right, good. The wind spinner is fixed. Oh no, more people joined. Uh, they marvel at the new functional technology repaired by being connected and working together. Uh, a few have joined our cause, convinced by goals. They all agree it's time to build a skyport and connect. Okay. Yeah, let's start building the skyport. Now, I believe I can now build houses on top of each other. Or is that what we're researching right now? That's what we're researching right now uh yeah that's water let's do that I mean, I would say high rise, baby, but it's it's two stories. Um, the top one looks like a cramped attic space. Is there any wood nearby that we can grab? It's a coal bed just there. Right, everybody is satisfied again for some reason i don't know why i don't think yay we got another ally you completed one section of the Triforce. Great. How many people just joined? Ah, oh, too many. Um, we have to supply us with one wood every hour. Why does no one give us food? Um, all right, we've run out of quartz. We need to build... Two more houses. Which we can easily do. Alright, now we're going to do some exploring. There's some courts there we can grab. I think more importantly right now. And there we got a little bit of coal. We can... I don't think... It, oh no, we can grab it already. Alright. Put one more on wood duty. We're almost at the stage where we have to start destroying our houses and rebuilding our flying city, but that sounds like it's going to be a real pain in the ass and I, I don't feel like it. We found this already, didn't we? No. Oh, you're a settlement. We also haven't pillaged this temple. Right, let's bring all these people back. Um, let's 
head here-ish. Storage is full. I've put this in such a stupid place again. Um, you would have thought I would have learned the, the uh, first time. down to 78% of our speed. I mean, we're not going to be collecting wood anyway because our storage is full, so... more courts out here this looks like the empty quarter that's a new big city over there um i should have wrapped up about 10 minutes ago but this game has got a little bit of one more one more in it um <laughs> hey welcome back night We got enough of everything to make it over the empty quarter. Um, yeah, I'm look at my flying city now. God, you used all your courts already. Holy shit, man! As you venture even further from our home, the landscape ahead grows taller and more jagged. One of our people has heard rumours of this place and we encourage him to speak what he knows. These are the highlands, a vast range of canyons, ancient kingdoms were built in these parts and they still exist today. Notably, there are fewer outcroppings of food so we should make sure to be prepared as we go forth. Alright, all stop. Um... Now, what do you mean by fewer? Oh, let's head back anyway, because there's water we can grab here. Did we ever rob this temple? We did. Um, I mean, liberate, liberate the temple. We use one and a half foods every hour. How much water do we use? One and a half. Uh, it's always good to have more wood. All right, we should probably stock up with coal. Oh shit, yeah, we really should stock up with coal. I just saw some. storage building do I no I don't think I can research one nope all 
Alright, so everything is more about stacking, which makes a lot of sense. There was that ability to uh, turn trees into coal. Can't remember who was selling that. Did we have a look at what these people were selling? In fact, it might have been you. It was. Ah, shit, I've lost that coal bed now. Probably going to move out of range of the water, but that's fine. We can pick more up on the way uh, back out. Our warehouses are full again. It's almost as if we're not building enough. Not quite right, but better than I thought. I need more people. tilting again a little bit a little bit <laughs> definitely have to put some more weight on the front here looks like the propellers do always need to be at the front take before I can stack these 16 hours Still grabbing the coal. I would like more coal storage. Oh, 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 I've lost my flying city. Um, we do have more lift than we need, although I kind of want to expand, so I think that's good. Since those two people jumped off, uh, people have been more satisfied. Apparently, uh, my society likes a good parachute jump. God, they love Point Break. All right, let's move over here for foods.
All right, food shouldn't increase our... Yeah, where how Oh, God, I can dump all of my resources. What am I, an airplane toilet? We did apparently run out of clay. There's not a huge amount left here, but... May as well finish it off. Uh, is anybody still collecting coal? Because they shouldn't be. Yes, five. <laughs> We're gonna call. Hey, Rogu, how's it going? I'm surprised that this coal deposit was in range. I don't even know where it is now. That's the clay, right? Yeah. I'm not seeing any balloons around a coal deposit because we're not hitting this one. Yeah, I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. We are 20 minutes past stop time, but I'm doing all right. We have apparently missed a, quite a bit of the map down here. Was I meant to bring people back here? Where do I go to see my quests on the map? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you want me to find a bunch of old libraries? I get it. Alright, the clay is empty. Our food storage is full, so we can put all these people back. Coal is full. Is there an oasis? Did we even loot this temple? We didn't. A lot of places we can seek workers from if I feel like that's a good idea. Now that we can double stuck houses, it's not the worst idea. Did we loot this temple? No, we didn't. All right. We could do a picking up some quartz, even though our storage is almost full. Our storage always seems to be full. Um, need to get all this double stacking research um, sorted out. enough for this yes All right, there we go we definitely have room for expansion I don't think we can risk going over there until we got a lot more food storage on board Massive oasis over here. 
And we apparently haven't been to this. This looks special. All right, chat, we'll head over here. We'll find out what this is. And then I really should stop stream, right? <laughs> Although I haven't finished my delicious ultra watermelon monster energy drink. I would not buy this again. I've lost that room and I want to... No, no, it's over here. I wish I could mark things. <laughs> then I might remember where I want to go. That was a big oasis at the end. This, we don't really need to worry about water. I think it's basically all we're collecting right now. Yep. Uh, let's head over here. I do believe I've perfectly leveled my city now. So that's nice. You definitely see its shadow now as well. A large forge glows hot with colour sparks, so the nearby settlement has been long abandoned. The metalwork is a similar colour to the sparks emanating from the forge. The exact alloy is a mystery, but it appears we can change the colours of our own metals with these new dyes. Alright, what new colours did we find? Oh, I can turn everything gold! Yes, audacious! Uh, what is the point of a floating city if it's still fundamentally two-dimensional? Uh, I think you're missing the point of the floating city. It floats. Are we researching? Alright, let's speed this up. Let's get this research done so we can start stacking warehouses. Yes, I know my construction storage is almost full. We're going to hopefully start double stacking warehouses, yo. All right, let's start to research food so we can double stack those. I'm assuming stacking them adds as much resource as it would as if it was just a new warehouse. Didn't actually look that up. Yes, yeah, that gives the same amount of storage because fewer resources to build and no extra footprint. Perfect. All right, whoever's collecting from the oasis, we don't need that anymore. Uh, we do need some clay. Anything else of in? What is that over there? We've never been there. Got another temple that we haven't hit. Another unknown settlement. Clay deposit. This also looks fancy. And we haven't been there either. Well, 
Where was that? Over here by this big oasis. Now again, I did say I was going to stop, but I want to see what this is. How are we doing for coal? Is there a coal deposit near here? Mm, could be a problem. Um, let's hope not. I'm also going to have to think about some more propulsion soon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's actually a lot of stuff over here. Um, not seeing a coal bed. This has got a name. This might actually be a new city for us to try and ally with. But we are a little bit low on coal. There's some coal there. Cantus Crossing. The people of Cantus live near the Valley of Kings and thus greatly value the treasure. The ancients, they are mesmerized by our flying machines and the council wishes to speak. They have a request. The band of seekers will not return for a long while, sent to a particularly desolate part of the Valley of Kings. They were searching for a tome described in legends, but must have become lost along the way, or perhaps worse. The seekers are only transport caravan in Cantus that can reach the Valley of Kings. If we could find the seekers and bring them home, their allegiance would be assured. Okay, we'll look for your lost man. Uh, a farm. All right, so these are repeats. I'm gonna I'm gonna pick up the farm. Um, man's been able to. Oh, oh no, there is coal. Is that coal? Yes. That's exactly why I clicked there by mistake. I saw that coal. Uh, Live to too much the world for too long. As soon as we can free ourselves from the clutches of Earth, I expect there will be immediate push into more complex three-dimensional design. Architects and artists will shake free of the shackles of old. Engineers will cry, though. I don't really feel it would be much different from what we do now, honestly. We build both up and down and to the side. Now, when you don't have gravity involved, you can probably do some more interesting things. Uh, have you seen like, anyone playing video games with even slightly mazy design? It's not fun. I played, um, I played the demo of that shooter that's set in space. So there's the kind of no gravity concerns and if they can slightly adjust the sickness factor, it might be worth playing. You do know buildings are designed in three dimensions, right? What is this? Is this just a thing? I can't click on it, so... Alright, we are now full of coal. I would like to be able to add more coal storage. I kind of want to research the farm, so I want this research to finish. Uh, there is a temple we haven't hit. Um, yeah, we could probably move over here a bit. I'm like half an hour past stop time. Uh, shooting set, sense of no gravity. Sounds like a more gamer-friendly marketing of how underwater combat would end up. Yeah, although there was that fairly good underwater battle royale we played, chat, which didn't find an audience, which didn't surprise me, but... It wasn't terrible. 
I can't remember the name of it for the life of me, but it wasn't terrible. I think there's something about the slowness of water which helps with that kind of combat in a way. Like there is a feeling of at least some kind of force that you're finding against, whereas the shooter in space. So like, you know, even if you shoot the gun, which kind of makes no sense, you're shooting a gun in space, but it doesn't matter because it was just a normal like gunpowder bullet gun. Um, the recoil did move you and like could send you like all in circles and stuff. Which is interesting. Uh, what do you reckon this is? Resources? Yes. Only two workers. Um, we'll just bring one back from the water. I'll try and remember the name of it because there is it, it is there is a free demo and uh, I do kind of feel like it's worth checking out just for its novelty. I also see there are two new free battle royales on my recommended um, Steam list this morning, which I didn't look at immensely. So that's a city we already know. Which way is the Valley of Kings? Right, we're going to go down south. Down south, innit? Some more that way. Uh, I believe I can double stack food now. Not that I know where my existing food types are. Those are. Oh god, was it food or water? No, it's definitely food. I did. Okay, that's a food silo. I could have sworn I had two. I did. There we go. Uh, if you look at the blueprints for a building, the creative design is more focused on the floor layout with walls simply being vertical continuation of the floor plan. Will you build up as I'm coming to treat to be creative along the height dimension? Yeah, but I don't know what more you would want, honestly, when it comes to creativity. I don't disagree with you and almost every architect seems to follow the exact same plan which is lots of glass and no character but I, I don't really know what it is you would want that isn't just a square box yeah I know we're missing courts keep your fucking hair on all right so we can now keep 130 foods It's going to be good. It would be nice if we could do our water as well. Um, all right, we can bring them off of the coal, although... Okay, this was our coal we were working on. Um... All right, so now I think we want to do storage water tower so we can stack them. Oh, that's going to take ages. So this farm. I would need two people to run it. It's 
going to say we must have looted that by now and it was south we wanted to head for the mission so i guess i'll see if we can finish this mission off and then i really must stop playing this and stop streaming and go and do other things um we haven't emptied out the food yet all right Yes, I know I don't have any courts. I know. Okay, we stocked up on food. We're stocked up on water. Uh, we got quite a bit of woods. Uh, let's head down south. Or south, right? Yeah, more kind of southeast, actually. We're back down to 61% speed. Seventy-one percent. There we go. That's more like it. Uh, you're not an artist, not creativity. You just look forward to God. We create this guiding old ideas of order. All right. So we haven't looted you. Are you in the rough direction? You are kind of in the area. We are just looking for a group of people, though. So I don't know what that's going to look like. There's a big castle looking thing here though. Oh no, I've been distracted. Uh, another ruin of the old empire rotting in the winds of the barrens. It seems there is more to this ruin below ground, but we hazard to attempt a voyage inside for a make collapse at any moment. We nearly leave, but... A ruby red scarf catches our eye. Was this the location of the seekers from Cantus? We scramble to remove the fallen stone. Quickly, we hear jubilant shouts from below the tower's base. The Seekers have fought themselves forever lost and are now saved by a sign of renewed empire. A few wish to join our council. Immediately upon rescue, and we're happy to oblige. With relieved hearts, we journey back to Cantus. All right, we, we found the people. Uh, we do need a couple more homes. Just build a few more than we actually need while we're here. Uh, if you could chop chop this idea, you would, but you're woefully incapable of that. Alright, I believe there was another temple to go and search. Quite a few ruins, actually. That one we've already done. There's also a settlement here. We may pick up some more people before we head back. Um, bring the two who are excited the one who's curious can fuck off if you're not excited you shouldn't be here all right that's more colors so we're definitely gonna head over here we've got to remember the important stuff One more farm may actually... Did we build that farm? May actually balance out our food requirements, you know. All right, now what colors did we get? Yeah, don't like it. <laughs> I just don't like it. We will grab all the quartz while we're here. Then we have to head back to Cantus, which is over to our northwest. It's over there, I think. It's probably going to be goddamn six o'clock. All right. God, we absolutely destroyed that.
Which fruit does a farm give? Right, we're leaning a little bit front heavy now. Uh, we emptied out the clay. We have right over to the northwest. I think that's where we're actually trying to go. We're a little lower on the old coal. We're using quite a lot of coal as we move around. You'll have a Chinese buffet on the other side that will even out the weight. I know we'd have to build quite a lot of farms to keep our. And make our village self-sufficient. Is that where we're trying to go? I think so. Yeah. All right, we can now double stack water towers as well. Uh, those are near the front. There they are. Yeah, we're definitely we're definitely front heavy now. Um, that helped us a little bit. Uh, was there a settlement here as well? Yes, right by the coal. Um, again, if you're excited, we got the houses. Oh, we don't need all these people doing that. Uh, anything else we want to... Did we ever build our double-stacked water towers? We're doing them now. I don't think we ever brought the water collector, did we? Might be worth going to find before we uh, head off somewhere new. Is it time to research the shrine? I need five people to do it. Oh, not to research. Okay. Takes five people to run a shrine. Jesus Christ, what goes on at the shrine? What happens at the shrine stays at the shrine. God, 65% speed, goddamn. Putting on too much weight. do use a lot of coal. Maybe that charcoal burner is worth picking up. Uh, Alright, 
we need two more houses. And they want a skyport, which is going to mean more, more houses. We're almost level again. <laughs> We've got quite a few spare houses for once. Uh, is there any wood for us to collect near here now that we've used quite a lot? I don't believe there was a car. Oh, can I reach this from here? I can. Oh, yes. Did you have the charcoal part? You did. Let's buy it. What am I researching right now? The shrine. Uh, they're gonna give us more wood every hour. Hooray! We're now an airborne settlement, but now everyone's gonna be unhappy. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're now gonna look after people's desires. I know how it goes. The bigger you get, the more people want. It's outrageous is what it is. Um, we're hitting a coal seam somewhere. May I have to think about building some more hangars, etc, etc, next time? be interesting to see um i wonder if it would actually tell me now here that's all trees into coal which is all at the town center workers don't like living near the charcoal hut because of its fumes i don't know how much it gives let's try and grab some more of that Uh, building another farm doesn't look like it's a terrible idea. So I built three. Um, don't worry about it. What's outrageous? The bigger you get, the more people want. That's what's outrageous. I also think we should go back around the cities we've already been to to see if we can find the one that was uh, selling the water collector. Oh, we are so close to parity for food. Oh, although we've put a lot of a lot of tilt on our city again. Um, it's a little bit front heavy. Hey Simon, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing well. Get told that a lot. Sadly, no. Ha <laughs> 